Hey Cougs, welcome back to another episode of In The Game. I'm Joe Michael Coronado here at NRG Stadium for the National Championship. There were 68 teams in the tournament and only two remain standing in Houston. The San Diego State Aztecs and the Connecticut Huskies will face off to see who will take home the biggest prize in college basketball, a national championship. San Diego State is coming off of a nail biter against Florida Atlantic with junior guard Lamont Butler hitting the game winning shot to advance to the national championship. It will be a tough task in the paint for San Diego State, going up against UConn's forward Adama Sinogo and freshman center Donovan Klingon dominating the rim. Sinogo should be a player to watch going into tonight's game after scoring 21 points and 10 boards against Miami on Saturday. UConn is 4-0 when they make it to the national championship game, with their last win coming in 2014. San Diego will look to play spoiler as they make their first appearance in a national championship. Both teams got off to a hot start in the first half. San Diego's guard Lamont Butler would set the tone by hitting a three to open the game. Despite a few turnovers from the Huskies, they were able to find a rhythm towards the 10 minute mark, hitting a couple shots and dominating the paint with forward Adama Sinogo. The junior forward had seven points and six rebounds going into the half. Despite a good defensive effort from the Aztecs, San Diego went three for 11 from three. Yukon would close out the first half strong by leading 36 to 24. It was a lot of the same in the second, with UConn continuing to have its way with the Aztecs' defense. San Diego's forward, Keyshaw Johnson, scored 14 points, trying to keep the Aztecs' hopes alive by bringing the score to 5 points at the 5-minute mark. But forward Adame Sinogo and guard Tristan Newton would be too much for the Aztecs. Newton would finish with 17 points and 10 rebounds, and the junior forward Sinogo also got in on the action with scoring 16 points and 10 rebounds, and has been named Final Four's most outstanding player. The Huskies would go on to beat the Aztecs 76 to 59. This is UConn's fifth national championship in five years with three different coaches. And it is only the second time a number four seed has won a national championship. It was a great finish to cap off a dominant tournament run for the Huskies. Well, there you have it, Cougs. That's another episode of In the Game. I'm Jermaine Coronado, and we'll see you next time.